Thank you. Thank you. John Ferns. I just wanted to say hello. The only good thing that's happened today, my car didn't start. I had an appellate argument. I have to be in Buffalo this afternoon, but I got to see you. So that's that's a Thank good you. thing. This is Frank Luciana, 94 years old and still on the job arguing cases amid his 67th year as a North Jersey criminal defense attorney. What I'd like to know is how come we got these beautiful women on here, you know? <laughs> you know what happens to me when I see these beautiful women? I feel like I'm only 93. <laughs> I spent the day with the courthouse legend as he argued a case before a state appellate panel for a Queens club owner who had been acquitted of a double murder but sent to prison on related drug charges. Frank Luciana had seen it all. After the court appearance in Newark, it was off to the Hackensack offices of Luciana and Luciana, where his two daughters are also attorneys. The third daughter passed away from breast cancer several years ago. The walls here are a monument to family and an amazing 67 year run. Also, a lot of actual runs. 1947, that's you in Madison Square Garden. Yeah, and I beat the guy from Columbia. And they had this wonderful lady, my mother, when I graduated from Fordham wow. University, 1948. His most memorable case, a 1975 case in which he successfully defended Dorothy Rapp, a woman accused of shooting her abusive husband. He argued successfully in her self-defense, and the case set a legal precedent for battered women who killed their abusers. But as a criminal defense attorney all these years, he's also represented quite a few scoundrels. I believe that God made us all different, but we're all the same and we're all God's children. That's it. That's why I go out and I represent these people. I don't care who they are. I feel we're all God's children and I, I just do the best I can to help them. In Hackensack, New Jersey, I'm Brian Donahue. Take it easy.